When we launched the iPhone four years ago, we completely revolutionized the phone. With the iPad, we invented a whole new category. The foundation of what made these products so successful is iOS. And with iOS 5, we've taken an operating system that was already years ahead, and we've added over 200 new features to it that move it even further ahead. We're constantly challenging ourselves to figure out how can we make the user experience even easier, even more intuitive, while at the same time adding more powerful functionality. And that's exactly what we've done with iOS 5. These days, we're all getting a lot of notifications. So we created a brand new way to handle them. When a notification comes in, it's now a subtle animation right at the top of the screen. But anywhere you are, you can just swipe down from the top of the screen and it'll reveal the notification center. And from within there, you can see all of your missed calls, your text messages. And if you tap on it, it'll take you directly to that application. And then on top of that, we made the experience in the lock screen even better. You're now able to see all of your messages. And with a simple swipe, you can jump right into the app that sent the notification. Magazine and newspaper publishers and their readers have fallen in love with the iPad. And so we're adding newsstand. Your subscriptions will be in one place and updated automatically so you always have the latest issue. And we've integrated the newspaper and magazine store right into newsstand. We also have a great new reminders app that helps you manage tasks and keep on top of all the things you have to do. It syncs with iCal and Outlook across all of your iOS devices. And it even includes location-based reminders, so it can remind you to do something when you arrive at a destination or when you leave somewhere. With iOS 5, we've integrated Twitter right into the OS. You'll only need to sign in once for all of your Twitter-enabled apps. And you can tweet directly from Photos, Safari, YouTube, and Maps. And with a tap of a button, you can optionally add your location. When the original iPhone shipped, it revolutionized mobile web browsing. Safari was the first full-featured web browser that people could take with them. And now it's even faster and more impressive. Reader is phenomenal. Reader gets all the clutter out of the way. It sets the font size right, and you just read through scrolling through the story. Reading List lets you save articles to read later on, and it automatically shows up on all your iOS devices. And with tab browsing, it's easy to quickly flip between multiple web pages. There's an old saying that the best camera is the one you have with you. With iOS 5, you have immediate access to the camera right from the lock screen, and you can use the volume button to snap your photo. We also added photo editing, so you can use one-tap enhance, red-eye reduction, and cropping right on the device. There are some really cool new features in Mail, like rich text editing. And there's even a new system-wide split keyboard to make it even easier to type. With AirPlay mirroring, you can share everything you do on your iPad 2 right up on your big widescreen TV. You can play video games, look at photos, videos, and surf the web, and all of it is shared with everyone around you watching the television. It responds to portrait and landscape rotations, to every pinch swipe and zoom, and best of all, you don't need a cable. You're free to move. iOS is the world's most popular gaming platform, and we're making Game Center even better. You can now add photos to your profile. We've made it easier to find new gaming friends. And you can even purchase new games right from within the Game Center app. Texting has become the way a lot of people stay in touch. Now, iMessage provides an easy way to send text messages, photos, and videos between iPhone, iPad, and iPod Touch users. With iOS 5, you no longer have to plug into your computer to back up and sync to iTunes. All you have to do is plug into power within range of your Mac or PC. 
Wi-Fi Sync automatically backs up and syncs your iPhone, iPad, and iPod Touch to your iTunes library. It's that simple. It's now possible to buy an iPad, an iPhone, or an iPod Touch and never own a computer. You can set up your device right out of the box without ever connecting to a Mac or a PC. We looked in every corner of the OS and asked ourselves, how can we make this better? And so this is the widest, most extensive software update ever for iOS. There is a feature for everyone out there.